firefighters, the police officers, the EMT, the 911. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. And our final speaker is Jim Coleman. Welcome. <laughs> Mayor, to the council, thank you for this opportunity. First of all, I want to thank you for what you've done for me. I'm a farmer out there in Nuttinger Town, and when I came here, uh, returned back home in 2020, I know what it's like uh, to receive the love of the mayor and the council. And our city needs a lot of love uh, at this time. As you all know, we're going through a lot of challenges, uh, both with public safety as well as with uh, our officers. And so, Instead of pointing fingers, which is not what we need, we need to all come together in our beautiful city. We've all been through a lot in the last three years, and I've got five recommendations that won't cost a lot of money, Mayor, which I think you'll be pleased with. The first and one your, is... Excuse uh, me for interrupting. And your 12th district, correct? Yes, Kathy Record, Pullman. I'm thank sorry you. about that. This is new to me. Uh, the first suggestion uh, is that I think we need to end the divisiveness in our city. And what I would like to suggest is that we declare that Lexington and in our beautiful city that all lives matter, including the lives of our police officers. The second is that we would provide our police officers the authority and the protection they need to issue warrants to dangerous criminals by reinstating no-knock warrants. President Obama would have never sent our Navy SEALs to take out bin Laden and to ask them to ring the bell at his compound to see if he would come out on the front yard to have a discussion. I think we need to be able to provide that same support as President Obama did to our Navy SEAL team oh. to be able to provide that same coverage to our police officers. The incidence of using no-knock warrants is not very high, but it does send a message to our police officers that they are going to be fully supported and that we would never send them into a situation to where their own lives would be at risk. Jesus it also Christ. sends a message to criminals that they can continue with their behavior uh, 